Good morning, student. Okay, so we will do a new lesson on your SST. That is lesson number eight, our occupations. Occupation, we are going to learn about this. What is occupation? Let me first tell you. Occupation means uh, a job or a work which help us to earn money. Okay, that is called occupation. There are three basic needs of life. These are food, clothes, and house. Underline this. Three basic basic needs of life are food, clothes, and house. Underline till here, okay? To fulfill our daily needs, we need money. But where does this money comes comes from? We have to earn money. In order to earn money, we need to work. Any job that helps us to earn money is called occupation. So, um, in our life, we need three things. That is food fooding clothing and also a house to live and in order to get all this we need to earn money without money we cannot get this thing so we need money and where does money comes from we earn money by doing different kind of job different kind of work okay so here it says any job or any kind of work that help us to earn money is called occupation underline this okay Still here okay people choose their occupation according to their skills and physical strength so we choose different kind of occupation means different kind of job different kind of work according to our physical strength according to how we can do how our body our physically we can do okay there are different type of occupations people work as teachers doctors farmers scientists carpenters mason shopkeepers etc so apart from all this there are more occupation more job okay these are some of the example of occupations now number one farming this is also a part of occupation farming is one of the main occupations in our country underline this main occupations in our country is farming from here till here a very large number of people in our country do farming. Different kinds of food grains, cereals and vegetables are grown in the fields. Cotton seeds, sugar cane, jute, tea, ground nut, etc. are the farming product. Flat surface of land and fertile soil are needed for good farming. A lot of water is also needed for irrigating the fields. Therefore, it is mostly done at places where these are easily available. So farming, it is one of the most important occupations in our country, that is India. And uh, under this farming, people grow, the farmer, they grow different kind of food, grains, cereals and vegetables and all. Okay, uh, things that they grow in the fields, these are called farming. And these are the examples. Okay. Okay, now the next one, cattle rearing. Cattle means including cow, sheep, goat and all. Cattle rearing is dependent on farming. Cattle are fed on the produce of the fields. Cows, goats and buffaloes give us milk. Bullocks are used for ploughing the fields. We get wool from sheep. So these are cattle rearing, okay? We, we used to... Uh, rear this kind of animals in order to get milk and also to let this animal help us on the field okay to plough the fields and also to get different kind of wool from the animals now poultry farm many people set up poultry farm this is the example of poultry farm okay a farm of a chicken poultry farming is done to get the egg and meat of hen duck etc so what are poultry farm Poultry farm are those farms so, uh, that we get egg and also meat of hen and ducks and all. Okay, cattle rearing and poultry farm, these are the two main part of, uh, these are also two main type of uh, part of farming. Okay. Uh, okay, this thing we will do in our next class. I think only this, till here we will do today, okay. Now I want to give you homework. That is on your exercise number A. Answer the following questions. It's very simple. So I want you to do question number 1, 2, 3, 4 and number 5. Till number 1 to 5, this will be your 
homework okay and the rest of the exercise and rest we will continue in our next class